you have officially earned it. That extra cash has built up to the point where you can buy a new car or maybe a really fancy electronic or possibly that vacation you've been working for your entire year. Who knows? And this is how to take advantage of your dream account during your 365 days to success. Let's make a right left. Yo. Do you have what it takes to make a right left to you? What's up, good people? I'm Thomas J. Beleza. Welcome to my video. If this is your first time to my channel and you want to learn how to succeed in entertainment, then subscribe by clicking the bell icon so you don't miss out. The rule of thumb with money is to save more than you spend. This is a pretty simple rule to live by. And with the rules of the three needs of purpose, organizing your money, it makes it easier to restrict yourself on spending and staying within your budget. Any person can buy what they want. And if it ever comes down to a what you need and what you want, the want can wait. Personally, I live by the code to vacation when my dream need affords it to me. It's that simple. Live by the three needs of purpose and take control over your finances. And here's a few rules to live by the dream need. The first thing I tell my clients about spending is allow your need of purpose to earn you the right to purchase. Now, there are a lot of methods out there, so any one of them is viable if you live by it and at least dedicate yourself to having some sort of control. And all this makes it easy to hold off on spending irresponsibly. Though there are a few rules out there that I have seen. I have heard people say, well, if you want to buy something, just make sure you have six months of overhead within your bank and then you have earned the right to buy something. I personally like to be slightly more protected and that is why I live by the three needs of purpose. But I personally believe that you have to protect yourself, invest in yourself and reward yourself. And that's where the value of the three needs of purpose comes in. When you have that six months over your average monthly overhead, Utilize the 60-40 split. And when you allocate enough money into your dream need, then boom, you've earned the right to spend. Secondly, always think of your dream need as a reward to thyself. Because, I, because honestly, you don't want to go on vacation before you can afford it. I mean, because I have dealt with clients that have gone on a vacation sporadically and came home to a very tight budget, not being able to afford it because they're kind of broke now. And this all comes down to them spending money they did not have to do something they did not earn. The rule to save now and buy later will always save you from stress. I also never understood why people buy high ticketed items when they do not have assets developing them wealth. This is a potential big reason why they are either A, always broke, or B, living on that line the red line. Happy trip, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Healthy tip. Create a list of rewards and goals. Turn it into a game for your brain. Maybe your big goal is a house or a new car. A smaller goal might be, I don't know, a computer. But ultimately, seeing a physical list helps you secure these goals with gumption. What I'm saying with lots of energy and crazy body language is this. Follow the flow of your dream account as it accumulates money. And additionally, a nice extra hey helpful tip is my mentors used to always tell me, <clears throat> why don't you develop assets that earn you capital gain that afford you the item? So for example, if they wanted a car, they would create an asset that earn them consistent annual capital gain. And then they would use that and make that buy the car. That's one way. That is usually a quick reward return for those who have their finances in order. But the truth is a smart business mind will always have good, strong management skill over both their budgets and their wealth growth. 
Thank you for watching this video and supporting these traveling adventures of a resilient entertainer. Please like, comment, and share the video along with subscribing for future content. If you have questions, let me know in the comments below. And as always, don't work too hard. But remember to look at the people around you so you can work together, grow together, and rise together. Do you have what it takes to make a right left here? A do punk. A do punk. Oh, I think I'm having a problem here. All right, we're going to have to cut the black. Cut the black. Cut the black. Oh, dear. Oh, dear.